the ID and blah, blah, blah of the patient in the NHIF, they should have transceded them into SHIF. But when they ask people <laughs> to register afresh with star 147 hash, it starts afresh and that's why there is this confusion. If we had moved with the NHIF cards, use that information and say everybody who is in, in the portal of NHIF automatically enters the portal of mm. SHIF, then it would have been almost seamless. So the problem is not that SHIF is bad, the problem is the mismanagement of that SHIF. The second problem is the communication department of the government, and I want to blame the government spokesperson, Isaac Mahura. They should have communicated to the public. The public doesn't even know that NHIF is more expensive than SHIF. A simple thing like that. NHIF is, is 500, SHIF is 300. But because you, the people, the big people, you are making noise, and Mama Hawa, how are you, Kwamba, to my own letter, Kitwambao, Ninafu, Nini Munaria, was Babu to Mamuliza Molipe Kidogo, more Kuliko, Akina Mama and Baa, Fanny Kazi. So it is failure on the part of our government to communicate effectively. I pray that as we go through the transition hiccups, that it ends up quickly and the matter can be put to rest. The debate around social health authority and social health insurance fund vis-a-vis -vis the old system has focused on the cost of the rollout, the billions of shillings that were pumped in. That is not Mwanaingi's business. What the government pays it's, it's got nothing to do with Mwanaingi. Mwanaingi has a service, he has a lot of money, he has a lot of money. He has a lot of money, he has a lot of money, he has But now the media and some politicians who are ill-informed, they have made Schiff look bad because of the challenge of asking where is this money going, who is receiving that money, is it Adani, or is it uh, the, uh, David Ndi's wife, or what have you, that has taken up the debate. My debate here in Kakamega should be services.